How's it going everyone, the Trout91 here back for the Susulo playthrough. This is episode number 10. We've hit our first milestone. Let's hope it's a good one. If you missed the previous episode, last time we were against Palermo and it was a home game that we dominated and won 3-1. Duncan opened up the scoring with that rocket, that beautiful left foot of his outside the box, smashed it past the goalkeeper. Palermo quickly replied at the other end with their first real opportunity of the game. We then took the lead once again in the second half through Stefano Sensu who found acres of space to put it into the back of the net. And then Gary Hooper silenced his critics again for the third game in a row he bagged himself a goal. That man is on form. Which begs me to ask the question for you guys. Who's your favourite FM forward this year? Or if you haven't played it this year, from a previous year. Now for today's episode, we go up against Pescara away from home. They're currently 11th in the league and we're still unbeaten for this campaign. We're going to be completely unchanged from today and the tactics are going to remain fairly similar. The only difference here is when we're retaining possession and playing at a normal tempo. I'm actually going to turn off for defence as well was to take our time about this because although I feel like we are a better team than Pescara, they could have a bit of the home advantage going for them and obviously us being the away team, it could go against us. So just going to make sure that forwards again are marked up. We always make sure that the wingers are closed down. Uh, I'm not going to tightly mark them at the moment. I don't want my defence to be dragged out too much. And I'm also going to make sure the Aquaman, the man we had on loan and terminated, is going to be close down when he gets the ball because he can be a scary boy just telling them that this is although this is an away game I want I'm expecting them to come out of a win now I want them to remain concentrated and up for this game Richie finds Sensi in the middle plays it off to Duncan Duncan finds Gary Hooper who's through on goal burning down Gary Hooper two minutes in shush boys he has scored for the fourth time in a row. I forgot the song last time. Let's do it this time. <laughs> Gary Hooper. Look at this. Completely away from the defense. Look at that chest down. One touch out of the foot. Smashes it across the goalkeeper. 1-0. So many critics of Gary Hooper. He's already on 10 goals for the season. I believe that's his fourth in the Serie A so far. He is performing beautifully. I mean, five games and he scored four goals. That's the kind of return you want from your star striker. Ball comes in. It's headed out. Brugman picks up the second ball. It's at the puck post. What a save! What a save! Oh, my goodness. I'm not sure what the defense is doing. They need to tighten up, but Jesus, what a save. We're going to get the loose scraps and we're on the attack again. We're on the hunt. Politano plays Gary Hooper again. Saw how good he was. When he scored his goal here, he finds Ricci at the back post. Can he do that little bit to get round? And it's not a great shot, but well played, boys. Great intentions. Duncan. Great free kick. Oh, my goodness. Looking for Ricci on the wing. What's Ricci going to do? He's coming inside. Everyone's being dragged out of position. Since he finds Duncan. Can he find one more? He finds Politano on the overlap. Oh, he can't get the ball in the middle. Duncan finds Hooper, though. Hooper lays it off to Ricci. Great stuff, boys. The football is... Mwah. Mwah. Lofts it to Politano, but the ball's headed down. Gilardino. This is some nice football from Pescara. Unfortunate for us. Bahabek. Oh, and again, Consigli is on form. Boys, I don't know what's going on here, but we need to stop this from happening. I'm actually going to make sure that we're tightly marking Bahabek. He's been on form so far. I don't want him to get any more sniffs at goal. Oh, my. They're on the attack again. Let's make sure we're marking up. They've got no one forward. Oh, wow. Jesus. I'm going to put Peluso and Nicholas Frey on defensive fullbacks. I don't like how easily they're being exploited on those wings. They find Baragi on the box. Cherby releases the ball to Ricci, who's going to give Gary Hooper with a long punt up front. Gary Hooper charging through on goal, and he's tackled by Bovo. End-to-end -end stuff at the moment. Very close game. Politano. Cherby falls to Magnanelli. What's he got? Can he find the pass? Sensi! Unlucky, boys. Ricci, what's he got? He's going all the way inside, dragging people all out of position. Hooper finds Duncan. Alfred Duncan goes for the shot. It's a tamed attempt. And Bizarri does a great job of holding on to that one. Could really do with that second goal. Politano manages to win a corner just to settle the nerves. This is very end-to-end. -end. Biscara definitely in this game at the moment. We need that second goal just to neutralize this momentum they got going. We get second corner off of this. Come on. Let's put that ball in the back of the net, boys just before halftime and really give us a big head start going into the second. Ball falls out to Duncan. Nicholas Frey this time. What the mother trucker was that? 
Balls fall into Magnanelli. They've given it straight back to us. Duncan, maybe Nicholas Frey knew what he was doing all along. Duncan finds Sensi. On the overlaps, Ricci. Ricci charges into the box. He goes a goal. Yes, boys. Ricci takes on all the odds and puts it round the keeper. 2-0 right before halftime. We are in control. That's got to be it. That's got. Look at this. They can't stop him. They know it's going to be a foul if they do. He slots it under the keeper. 2 to the nil. All right, well played, boys. I'm really enjoying what you're doing out there. Very, very happy. Uh, that actually had no effect whatsoever, really. Like, usually you give a positive thing, and it has a positive impact. Clearly, they don't respond to passion and positivity, so I'm just going to be negative. I'm going to be like, you're all slags, and <laughs> you're all absolutely terrible footballers. Your mother should have put you up for adoption, and you're a waste of oxygen, and society would be better off without you. Was that too far? Got quite a few yellow cards out there at the moment. Nicholas Frey even's picked up another one. That's five men, one card away from sending off. Duncan plays in the ball. Sensi picks up. Magnanelli on the edge of the box. Releases Ricci. Ricci has an ambitious effort. It's taken down. Duncan picks up scraps. Ricci again goes for the shot. Oh, my God! Ricci! 25-yard screamer! What a boy! He scored six goals already this season. He's on firing form today. Look at this. Left foot and all. Bang! Oh, and the dirt is gone. They made two substitutions. Pepe is a winger, so we're going to make sure he is taken down. And Vera is a midfielder. I'm just going to leave that as it is. And I think we might make a substitution. Let's bring on Pahela Guarini as an attacking playmaker. Just give him some game time. I don't want Sensi to get sent off. Oh, Gary Hooper's almost bagged himself a second goal there. We are on top at the moment. Tries to give it to Ricci. Duncan picks up the scrap. It's found Ricci on the overlap. Is this the Hattie he's been waiting for? Oh, so close. Right, let's take off Duncan as well. I think the job's done there. Give Mazzatelli some game time. I think we're going to take Gary Hooper on. Give Ranella a go. Oh, no, they've given away the ball. Bahabek charging down the left. Nicholas Frey with an important tackle there. Clean as well. You know Pascara lining up for something. They had a little bit of, of momentum going their way. Pepe runs inside. It's terrible defending in the end. <sighs> Tighten up, boys. We had a clean sheet going here. It was a fantastic day out. And you've let it slip. Not good defending there. I think that might have been Ante or Cherby who gave that one away. Politano. Oh, it's deflected to Mazzatelli. Finds Pellegrini. Feeds him, reaching for the hat. He is offside. There it is. 3-1 to Sassuolo. Amazing effort. Still maintaining that unbeaten run at the moment. And I'm very pleased with how the boys are playing right now. They are on fire. And there's not many teams, I think, that will be able to stop us at this rate. We are just short of first place as well by two points.